welcome to KO tutorials. So let's continue with the next part of this tutorial. So let's get started. So as you can see over here, we have started with the lighting of this particular game environment over here. So let's continue it. So as you can see over here, I have added some photometric lights over here for the light post over here that is a light pole over here. Let us go over here. I will take a V-ray light and I can go into this and I can make it as dome. Let us make the type as uh, dome over here and make the temperature as a bit bluish. So, you can go into the color and make the temperature a bit darker over here. So let us try to render this and see how it is looking like. Okay, It is giving a very very uh, bluish color tone over here. I will just select this light. I will make this as bluish color in this way. This looks a bit better. Not only this. Again, I will just select this light and we can just make a copy of it. We can make copy of this light over here. Let us select this. And I can slightly increase the intensity of the light. So, if you want to increase the intensity, you can slightly increase the intensity of the light. I can just make it as 3. If you want, you can make it as uh, plain as well. just giving you a dark look over here. Just a sec. <coughs> Got hanged, I guess. I will just save the file once. So, 
now if you see this over here if I uh, slightly rotate this as you can see now it is just giving me a bit of a darker look we need a bluish tone over here so it's better I'll just make it as a dome over here that would be better so I'll just drag this dome here and let's just give a color to it okay this looks a bit better and if you want you have a dome radius emit radius as well so how much you want the emission that can be shown so I have just off this particular stuff over here so I have just selected this I just made it as invisible I will just make one more copy I will take it as an instance over here it's become <coughs> showing you a bit of a bluish tone over here simultaneously I can just go over here You can even put one one V ray lights. I'll just slightly rotate it. I can just drag it inside, but this is a let's try to render this so you can show some lights uh, inside this as well if needed so I can make some copies of it ok over here So we can see some lights over here as well. Okay, that's very less. Uh, if you want, you can slightly select the intensity, although the intensities are high you can slightly change the temperature if required ok so whenever you are showing a night scene it's going to look like this only Now, again, 
again let's go over here i'll again take a copy of that light and we can just slightly drag it inside can show the light over here <coughs> if needed in this way slightly also add one more light so this is going to be uh, you know illuminating the scene so let's select this light let's give a temperature make it as 2 If you are only going to give a yellowish light, then it's of no use. So I'll just make it very less. Then I'll render this for a support. Can just give zero point four, or else I can just shuffle this. so let's not uh, increase more of the intensity over here so even if i make it as 1 so as you can see it is going to illuminate a bigger area so i don't need that much i can make it as 0.5 double sided invisible that would be better over here so you can just uh, make it lesser make it less if any fin case if you want to manually do that i can manually do that can do that manually so for example let's take this area and now see if you want to manually uh, highlight any of the houses we can give some lights with the lesser intensity i'll just give some lights with the lesser intensity over here now if you see this you will be able to see the houses all right so guys if any doubt please put it in the comment section over here so please like and subscribe my youtube channel if you not subscribed yet so we'll continue the rest of the part in the coming tutorial so thanks for watching this tutorial